Well, hey guys and gals, welcome back to Swiss Touch with me, my console. And, uh, due to uh, demand, we're gonna say bye bye to this thing. And um, we did ask at the end of the last episode, should we uh, change this out for one of the uh, other bailers with the big long arms on it? And, uh, yeah. We got a more or less a yes response to that. So I thought we'd do that now. Um, the only thing I've done from the last episode is uh, I've moved the harvester onto a the next field. Oh, bounce that over there. And uh, I took a new piece of equipment we borrowed up to the logging area. We'll get down to that in a second. Let's get this thing sold. Don't go too far to the trigger. Yay, we have sold it. Uh, so, yes. Um, where are we going? Forest? No, Balin. So, we asked at the end of the last episode, should we change our Baylor up to one of these things? Uh, yeah. With the big long arms on it. And I have two. I have this one and I have this one. Both con. But there's two different models. Uh, this one's oh, this one takes a hundred horsepower, and this one is hundred forty horsepower. Same width, same price. Uh, we'll go for the lower model. Foil color, pink. Main color, pink. Rim color, yes. Design color. Oh, it's not pretty. That is pretty. Ah. That one. It's going to cost us 62,500. That'll do nicely. Yeah, uh, before we get on the. Oh, that is pretty. Before we go on that, let's go and get the the, uh, the harvester emptied. We changed the Brooks out as well for the um, the all in one. I think it's Stevie's model. Um, again, we're only using that for the the big trees that are uh, you know it takes you half an hour to cut them down by hand. I don't think we'll very see that. I don't see that used too often. Where's the harvester down here? I've changed the uh, the course place set up this. I'm doing eight, eight headlands on it to see if that helps us any. Because I know that other field was a nightmare with the headlands for to get the other bits of the field done. So, yeah, while we're doing this, uh, Gunnar was saying, your game, your choice, you play for your enjoyment. Uh, I would get it also. Um, I had the class bailer also but get rid of it because it missed too much. So now I'm using the con with a bit of an OP pickup width, but love and enjoy it. Is that the same one as I've just bought, Gunnar? Be interesting to find out, actually. Uh, Trucker85D was saying, you're the champion, keep the videos coming. Thank you. Uh, what are we going to hide you? here. You shouldn't be a problem for a while anyway. Uh, so yeah. Um... I think most people are saying about going for this bailer, you know, any of the replies that I've got for it. So we'll uh, see how this works now. Oh, that's why it was so cheap. Oh no, that's the round bailer with the wrapper. Oh, my console, what are you doing to yourself? That's why they have two of them. <coughs> we don't need that one. Oh, you mop it. We're not doing round bales. Just cost ourselves 20 grand there, didn't we? I 
I was wondering why I had two of them, but this one we need. Wow. Um, I don't think we're too. I don't think we're mud. Oh, I don't think we're too fussy for money at the minute, so. I'll not worry about the 20 gram we've lost too much. I'll uh, keep that one under advisement. So there you go, now I've, we've learned something today. Well, I've learned something today anyway. Ooh. That's a bit nuts. I do have access to this land, I want it. Don't be stupid. Oh, this is going to make it a lot easier for Bailin. A lot easier. Wow. I suppose this is going to, uh... We get the field work done quicker. Get the stuff for the animals, that means we can do back into the log and more. That's a good thing. Isn't it? Corey Burnett was saying, uh, what was he saying? Let me see. Uh, efficiency, kick ass. Oh, I missed a bit. Uh, get we done. And I think that's a reply to get the big bailer. Well, there you go, we've got it. Bills are flying out of it though. I think we'll upgrade the cedar and stuff as well, um, shortly. I know we have to upgrade our combine and all yet. Oh, that is making a short work of that, isn't it? Don't even need course to do this one, do we? Oh, that's a field done. Um, it unloads better too, which is uh, pretty cool. Yeah, it unloads far better than the the, uh, the, the class we did. Well, I think we'll find our new bailer. Probably should have done it in the green colours, being that we're using the green stuff on this map, but... You know, there's only so much ugly green you can look at before you start going nuts. Yeah, I think there's enough ugly green. Just push it away. Uh, I put that there. Get those bills after actually while we're here. I uh, see Joseph Sakovich was saying, uh, Buy the Joker Bailer. There you go, Joel. I'll keep you happy. And also, as well, uh, Kevin Jensen. Ooh, that's a new person. I don't think I've seen you comment on before. We'll come along. Um, he was saying, Get the Bailer. There you go, got the Bailer. It definitely didn't make that a lot easier, I'll give that. I'm gonna throw these ones down here, in with the uh, dairy cows. I don't know if you've seen it, I did it, I updated the cattle mods, and I can't remember if I said this in the last episode or where I was done between that. <coughs> um, it changed the cows around a bit, so I had to swap the cows out around a bit as well. I think I might have had that in the last episode, not sure. Um, Let's see, square bills, that'll do. I'll load on. Let's 
Let's go meet him with the animals a lot easier as well. Quicker. Than this. Um, Forestry, I don't think we'll get around. I'll show you the new machine we've we've uh, borrowed in the forestry, but I've uh, something else I want to try this episode that I've been meaning to do a few episodes now and it just hasn't got around to it. So, um, I'll try that first. I'm going to try and work on filling some grass or some silage chaff into the, the bunker there at the cows today. I still haven't picked up the uh, silage bales we wrapped the last time, the, the chimp bales, so we'll have to get that done at some stage as well. Oh, uh, look at you, one bale. Surprise, surprise. So, um, let's swing this around, and I'll pack the bill at, at a later date. I just gotta use the other little fuck to pack them away anyway, so they're you're not gonna miss much there. Um, do you wanna, I think I'll throw them along this fence line for now. And I can move that across, can't I? So, how do we move it across? Uh, F1 menu. Move marker to the left. Just keep def control and keep at four. There we go. Unload is Y. I'll pack them away, guys, again. Um, you know, you've seen me do it up there before, or have you? I can't remember if I've done that on screen or not. Last of the bills. I know some people have been having uh, trouble with this uh, auto load set in uh, multiplayer and stuff. I'm having absolutely no issues with it in single player. Maybe it's just a multiplayer thing. Uh, I'll just unload it there. Which is why. We're not going to actually need this trailer today, am I? Uh, are we going to need the tractor though? Probably. Get that planted up again offline. So you see, well, we're doing pretty well with equipment and with our with our animals. The sheep are grand. I mean, I've just looked at them just before um, I started recording. There, they're they're flying. Um, Doing pretty well. Is that there? Is that out of water, maybe? No, it's working fine. Maybe we'll need to put water in at some stage. Ah, yes, we're going to need to take you back to the shop for this next bit, aren't we? Right, so, as you see, guys, the. the uh, top field up there, oh you can't see it from here, with the grass field, I have it already cut. There's something I see around here, in, in this part of Ireland, anyway, in Northern Ireland, for picking up grass, is people using forage harvesters. I'm going to try this one again. Now, I know it didn't work it's too well. Um, it didn't work too well on Glen Isla, but I think that was my problem, my fault, because I hadn't got it in the right mode for course play. So I thought we'd maybe try it again here. Alright. What I'm going to use for picking up though, is I'm going to use, where is the headers for this forage header? Sorry, here. It's one of these bad boys here. Uh, four, five meter. Three meter. I'll go with that one. And we're just leasing it, guys, because, um, I'm not going to buy it because it doesn't work. Oh yeah, harvester needs to be unloaded. We'll get to that in a second. Is that how much it cost us to lease that? Oh. That's if this, this thing can make it up to that field. I have a feeling it's going to be stuck in the box. Yeah, I see there's a lot around here for, for lifting and making silage for, well, really just because you want to put it that way. 
Um, so I thought I'm going to try it on the here and see how it works on this map. Got the wider header because the um, big M seems to like cutting it wide. Hey, where did this start? Start somewhere down here. All right, so course play this work mode. As we, we that's the, the problem we made the last time. Do one move. Where's the starting point now? Up there. Did I change it? Oh, I did. I changed it when we used from the uh, butterfly mode to the big amp. Duh. So here we are. Fill one mode. It looks to be very offset, doesn't it? Okay, we've made a boo boo. Um, what I will do though, let me get this other one, this this harvester unloaded, and we'll uh, we'll try a different approach to it. We'll have of course play following me when I unload it. I'll drive the harvester. So guys, yeah, I'm. I know I've said it before, but I'm actually really, really enjoying this map. Um, it's presenting us with its challenges. That's without a doubt. I know there's been a few people. Now, I, I, I did miss a couple of um, recordings, uh, you know, release slots there last week. Uh, just through work, guys. Nothing, you know, nothing I could have done to have avoided that. Um, unfortunately. Oh, we're doing oats in this field. I forgot to plant the oats. Duh. I know this is meant to be our... Uh, we'll, we'll call this the log on an animal map. I think the farming of the grains is just basically a way of getting the... Uh, the stuff we need for the animals. I don't know why I want to do pigs on this map or anything like that, guys. Um... Pigs aren't really. Where is. Pigs aren't really my cup of tea. Don't know why, I just don't like working with. I love working with cows. Sheep look after themselves. I'm gonna need some sort of tipper for this. So let's, uh. I'm gonna have to keep the tipper low as well because of the way the thing is. Uh, small enough because of the hills. What have we got in here? Uh, nothing really interesting. Joskin. Oh, that holds 30,000. And it holds chaff. Cool. 50,000 is a bit much, isn't it? Uh, oh, we'll just keep it the way it is. We'll buy it. Let's go and do a bit of chaffing. Again, I'll, I'll not use course play to break it down um, the hill. I'll do all that part myself, I think. Uh, I'll just use course play to follow me while I have the harvester on the go. Uh, the chopper on the go, even. I think that'll be the easiest way of doing things. And then we'll run down and empty it into the uh, side each side of ourselves. The chaff side of it, I don't know what you want to call it. You decide. 
Okay, guys, if you have any suggestions for mods or anything you'd like to see on this map, please leave a comment down below and let me know. All comments are uh, greatly appreciated. I do tend to get back to them as quick as I can, guys. Again, sometimes real life gets in the way. It's not going to take as long to fill as up. Is. It's not working. So I think we can say that the JD is a bust. So, let's get rid of it. Maybe I'm just doing something wrong, but I don't know. But, uh... We'll stick with something that works. The Rustle Mash works. Oh, why have I got that? That's a modern version. What's that a modern version? Shame that we have to do this again. Oh no, wrong, wrong category. It's that one. It's a shame that that's that's happening with that that John Deere like three point one meters. But you know, there's nothing we can do. Um, nothing we can do about that. I guess it's just a modern version of the end game, but I don't know what's different about it. Hope it goes a bit faster, maybe that's it. I don't know. Things are definitely very bouncy. It's a shame about John Deere. I mean, it was. I know I don't like John Deere as a brand, but you know. It would have been nice to use something rather than the in-game stuff. And I know this is a mod, but it's still in-game. I'm gonna have to uh first need to unfold the pickup, okay. Fold it. Drop it. Did we drop the header on that other one? Ah that was the problem. Alright, you're not wanting to follow us because you're on the job here. So if we stop just started to that make a difference. I don't think it's working out, is it? Is it?
Might as well try and choose the combat herself. Fourteen. Okay, now we're having a nightmare. Of course, though. <coughs> I don't understand this. Oh, me and course plays not having a good day today. <coughs> there is always the uh, follow me. I suppose uh, we could try that. I haven't tried that yet. Oh, well, we'll try follow me. Yeah, let's try follow me. So, let's see, put that up. Follow me. Uh, right control and F. Right control, F. Does that work? Is it filling up? That's the thing. How do we change the distance for the, the follows? That's that would be the thing, wouldn't it? Uh, one second, let's let's just have a look and see if we can get this the distance thing sorted out here. Mod hub. Follow me. Just on the mod hub while we're doing this, guys. Um, easiest way to do it. Uh, Alright, so follow me, talk a lot of myself distance. Distance minus right control and W. Right control and W. You're gonna crash. Bang, told ya. We're not having fun. Distance plus right control and S. Ten meters maybe? Let's have a try this. Seems to be working. This thing just went away down the hill, we'll be flying. I think it would be better just with a loading wagon here, guys. Uh, we'll try putting the offset up on it, that's maybe what we do. So offset, uh, offset to the, we'll offset to the right, uh, by right control and D. Right control and D, and left control. By, say, two and a half meters. Um, and we'll double that. Oh yeah, you push me into the way, sure, why not? I'm going to go to more than two and a half meters, aren't I? So, right control D. Are you there? I should have done this one to the left because we were turning to the Oh, now we're cooking on gas. That's it. Ha <laughs> ha! 
so nice to have follow me back. I'm going to set the uh, cruise control on this one down, guys. To say 6 miles per hour. Because that is going way too fast for me. Even. There you go, guys. Now, now we're cooking on gas. We just have to watch the fill level now. Perhaps I need to have that come closer. Well, there, there's where it's meant to be. Why? This is going to take a while. Right, so we're ninety nine percent anyway, so what I'll do is I'll take it down and empty it up. Uh, we're gonna have to try and get horse <sighs> place sorted out. So, how do we stop? Follow me then. Actions. Follow me. How do we turn? Follow me is right control and F again, isn't it? Course play. You're useless. So we'll get this one on empty, guys. And I think that would be uh, us tonight. Don't forget to hit the like button, guys, and uh, share and. Uh, you know, if you haven't already hit that subscribe button, anybody new who's come along to the channel, welcome along. And, uh, oh, one more, down here. All those people who've been here from the start, cheers for sticking around, guys. Much appreciated. I'll have to reverse up in here, aren't I? Oh, wrong way. So, um,. Should we continue on doing the uh, grass settings that way? See if we can get it perfected or just use a load wagon. Kind of like the idea of it because I see it up around here, but it's going to be um, problematic like that. I mean, I can't understand why Course Play's not doing it. Is it maybe because it's a modded. Uh, a modded. Uh, what do you call it? Forest Harvester, I don't know. Oh, it's coming through the back. That's not good. But anyway, guys, uh, I'm going to be working away at this off screen for a while and see if I can get it perfected a bit. Um, but for me, my console for now, uh, in a couple more days, there'll be another one of these out and we'll see what more we can get up to, what we're going on against. And for me, for now though, I'll see you later. Bye bye.